Imogen Coca, a trailblazing actress, left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Born in 1980, she began her career in vaudeville before transitioning to television in its early days. In 1948, she became one of the first female stars of live television, co-starring in the groundbreaking comedy program Your Show of Shows with Sid Caesar. Coca's unique comedic style, which combined physical comedy, facial expressions, and quick wit, quickly made her a fan favorite. Over the course of her career, she received six Emmy Award nominations and won two, including for Your Show of Shows and for her own variety series, The Image and Coca Show. Beyond her work in television, Coca also appeared in numerous films and stage productions. She starred in the original Broadway production of Little Me, for which she received a Tony Award nomination. She also appeared in films such as National Lampoon's Vacation and The Opposite Sex and How to Live with Them. Coca's contributions to the entertainment industry helped to pave the way for future generations of comedic actresses. Her ability to make audiences laugh and connect with her characters has made her a beloved figure in the world of entertainment. Even today, her work continues to inspire and delight fans of all ages. Imogen Coca was a talented actress best known for her work in comedy. She was born in Pennsylvania in 1980 and started her career in vaudeville before moving on to Broadway and television. Coca starred in the popular 1950s sketch comedy Show Your Show of Shows with Sid Caesar. One of her most defining roles was in the 1955 movie The Seven Year Itch Opposite Tom Mule. Coca's unique comedic style and ability to play a wide range of characters set her apart from her contemporaries. We would love to hear from you. What do you believe is the work that defined Imogen Coca's career? What made her stand out from other actresses in her era? Do you have any cherished memories or personal experiences related to this classic star? Share them with us in the comments below. Throughout this video, we will be sharing some fun, shocking, and sad facts about Imogen Coca, so make sure to keep watching. Imogen Coca was born in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania in 1980 to immigrants from Switzerland. Her father was a violinist and her mother was a pianist, which exposed her to music and performing arts at a young age. Coca's parents encouraged her to pursue a career in dance, and she began studying ballet when she was five years old. Coca's family moved to West Palm Beach, Florida, where she continued her dance training and performed in local productions. She also developed an interest in comedy and acting, which led her to pursue a career in show business. Coca's first big break came in the 1930s when she joined the vaudeville circuit, performing in various skits and comedy routines. She later appeared in several Broadway shows, including Straw Hat Review and New Faces of 1934. One of Coca's key influences and mentors was her husband, Robert Burton, who was also a performer. They met while performing together in a vaudeville act and married in 1935. Burton encouraged Coca to develop her comedic skills and helped her create many of her most memorable characters. Coca's unique blend of physical comedy, facial expressions, and comedic timing quickly made her a favorite among audiences and critics alike. She was known for her ability to create humor out of everyday situations and her knack for improvisation. In the 1950s, Coca starred in the hit television show Your Show of Shows alongside Sid Caesar. The show was a groundbreaking variety program that featured comedy sketches, music, and dance numbers. Coca's performances on the show helped establish her as one of the top comedic actresses of her time. Coca's influence on comedy and show business can still be seen today. Her unique style and comedic genius continue to inspire performers around the world. Imogen Coca was a significant figure in the film industry during her era and beyond. She was best known for her work in comedy and made a name for herself as a talented actress and comedian. Coca's contributions to Hollywood began in the 1940s and continued for several decades, earning her a place in the annals of film history. Coca's influence on the film industry was substantial. She was one of the first female comedians to gain widespread recognition and success in Hollywood. Her unique comedic style, which often involved physical comedy and facial expressions, set her apart from her contemporaries and made her a fan favorite. Coca's work in television was particularly noteworthy. She starred in several popular shows, including Your Show of Shows and Sid Caesar Invites You, which aired in the 1950s. 
These shows helped to establish Coca as a household name and solidified her status as a comedy legend. In addition to her work in television, Coca also appeared in numerous films throughout her career. She starred in movies such as Uncle Joe Shannon and The Opposite Sex, showcasing her versatility as an actress. Coca's contributions to Hollywood went beyond her work as an actress and comedian. She was also a trailblazer for women in the industry, paving the way for future generations of female comedians and actresses. Overall, Imogen Coca's impact on the film industry cannot be overstated. Her contributions to Hollywood, both on and off the screen, helped to shape the industry and left a lasting legacy that continues to be felt today. Imogen Coca, a talented actress and comedian, discovered her passion for performing at a young age. She was born into a family that loved the arts, and her mother encouraged her to explore her creativity. At the age of seven, Imogen began taking dance lessons, which sparked her interest in the world of entertainment. As a teenager, Imogen continued to study dance and also developed a love for acting. She started performing in local theater productions and quickly gained a reputation for her comedic timing and expressive face. Imogen's talent and dedication to her craft led her to pursue a career in entertainment. One pivotal experience that fueled Imogen's desire to become an actress was seeing a performance of the Ziegfeld Follies. She was captivated by the glamour and spectacle of the show and dreamed of one day performing on a big stage. Imogen's passion for performing only grew stronger as she got older and she eventually moved to New York City to pursue her dreams. Imogen's hard work and dedication paid off when she was discovered by Broadway producer Max Gordon. He was impressed by Imogen's talent and offered her a role in his upcoming show, Something for the Boys. Imogen's performance in the show was a huge success and she quickly became a sought after actress in the world of theater. Imogen's career continued to soar with her successful run on the television show your show of shows where she starred alongside Sid Caesar. The show was a hit, and Imogen's comedic skills were on full display, making her a household name. In conclusion, Imogen Coca's passion for performing was ignited at a young age, and she pursued her dreams with determination and hard work. From her early days taking dance lessons to her successful career on stage and screen, Imogen's love for the art shone through in every performance. Imogen Coca was a notable figure in the world of comedy. She was featured in the book Who's Who in Comedy and profiled in Funny Ladies. Coca's career included a wide range of performances, from television to Broadway. One of her most memorable Broadway roles was in the 1978 production of On the 20th Century, for which she received a Tony Award nomination for Best Actress in a Featured Role in a Musical. Coca's performance was highly regarded showcasing her comedic timing and versatility as an actress. Coca's contributions to comedy have left a lasting impact, and she continues to be celebrated for her work in the field. Her performances have brought joy and laughter to audiences, and her legacy continues to resonate today. Imogen Coca, a talented actress, faced many challenges in her early career. Born in 1980, she grew up during a time of financial hardship and economic uncertainty. Despite these difficulties, she discovered her passion for performing at a young age and pursued a career in show business. However, the entertainment industry was not always welcoming. Coca struggled to find work and often faced skepticism from industry professionals who doubted her abilities. She also had to deal with financial struggles as she struggled to make ends meet while pursuing her dream. Despite these obstacles, Coca remained determined and resilient. She found creative solutions to overcome these hurdles, such as performing in small venues and taking on any acting job she could find. She also continued to hone her craft, perfecting her comedic timing and physical comedy skills. Coca's hard work and dedication paid off when she was discovered by Sid Caesar, who cast her in his groundbreaking television Show Your Show of Shows. The show was a huge success, and Coca's talent was finally recognized by a wider audience. Throughout her career, Coca faced many challenges, but she never gave up. Her resilience and determination serve as an inspiration to aspiring actors and actresses everywhere, showing that with hard work and perseverance, anyone can overcome obstacles and achieve their dreams.
Imogen Coca was known for her love of animals, as demonstrated by her purchase of a crippled duck while on vacation in California. She nursed the duck back to health on the terrace of her Manhattan penthouse. Coca also had a successful career in comedy, often working alongside Sid Caesar. They were not married, but their long-standing professional partnership led many to assume they were. Coca would often find audiences whispering and pointing as she walked by with Caesar and his wife, who was tall and gorgeous. Despite this, Coca always complimented her on her sense of humor. Coca also starred in the TV show It's About Time as a character named Shad. In the pilot episode, her character was originally called Shag, but the name was changed after producers learned that Shag is a slang vulgarism in the UK. However, they did not reshoot the pilot, which aired with the original name. Coca's talent and professionalism were evident in her ability to adapt to changes and continue delivering a great performance. Imogen Coca, a pioneering actress in television, had several breakthrough moments in her career. In the 1940s, she gained recognition for her work in the NBC comedy show The Imogen Coca Show, where she demonstrated her exceptional talent for physical comedy. This show marked a significant turn in her career, as it paved the way for her to become one of the first female stars in early television. Later, in 1951, Coca's career reached new heights when she starred in the groundbreaking comedy series Your Show of Shows alongside Sid Caesar. The show was a critical and commercial success, and Coca's performances were widely praised. Critics and collaborators alike hailed her as a master of comedic timing and expression, with her work on the show earning her an Emmy Award for Best Actress in 1952. In 1966, Coca took on a more dramatic role in the Broadway play The Apple Tree, for which she received a Tony Award nomination. This marked a departure from her usual comedic roles and showcased her versatility as an actress. Throughout her career, Imogen Coca's work was marked by her unique comedic style and her ability to captivate audiences with her expressive face and body language. Her contributions to the world of television and theater have left a lasting impact, inspiring generations of comedians and actresses to come. Despite the passage of time, Coca's work continues to resonate with audiences, and she remains a beloved figure in the annals of entertainment history. Imogen Coca, a talented singer, dancer, and actress, began her stage career at a young age. She took piano lessons at five, singing lessons at six, and dance class at seven. Making her stage debut as a nine-year-old dancer and performing her first solo singing stint at age 11, Coca's natural ability and dedication were evident from an early age. Despite her outgoing and lively onstage persona, Coca was known for her gentle and shy demeanor offstage. However, her life took a dramatic turn in 1973 when she was severely injured in a car accident. The accident resulted in the loss of sight in her right eye, a split leg, a broken cheekbone, and a fractured ankle. Throughout her career, Coca's talent and hard work earned her critical acclaim and a devoted following. Despite the challenges she faced, including her injuries from the car accident, Coca continued to perform and entertain audiences for several decades. Her contributions to the world of entertainment will always be remembered and appreciated. Imogen Coca, a talented actress and comedian, had a unique approach to her work. She was known for her physical comedy and facial expressions, which she used to great effect in her sketches and performances. Coca's style was often described as natural and spontaneous, with a seemingly effortless ability to make people laugh. A key aspect of Coca's creative process was her willingness to take risks and try new things. She was not afraid to look silly or ridiculous on stage, and this fearlessness allowed her to push the boundaries of what was considered acceptable in comedy at the time. Coca's willingness to experiment and take risks helped her to develop a unique and memorable comedic voice. Coca's personal experiences and worldview were also reflected in her work. She was born in Pennsylvania to immigrants from Portugal, and her experiences growing up in a working-class family influenced her comedic sensibilities. Coca often played characters who were struggling to make ends meet or navigate difficult situations, and her performances were marked by a deep empathy and understanding of the human condition. Despite facing many challenges and obstacles throughout her career, including discrimination and sexism in the entertainment industry, Coca remained committed to her craft and continued to push herself as an artist. Her dedication 
and perseverance helped her to leave a lasting legacy in the world of comedy and entertainment, and her work continues to inspire and delight audiences to this day. Imogen Coca, a well-known actress, faced challenges in her later years due to Alzheimer's disease before her passing. Coca's career took off with her breakthrough role in the Broadway review New Faces of 1934. Her comedic talent was so impressive that it even caught the attention of a young Mike Sims and his friend during a play in Houston, TX. They laughed so hard that Coca noticed them in the middle of her performance. Imogen Coca was a significant figure in the entertainment industry, particularly in television's early years. She was one of the first women to gain recognition as a comedian and was known for her physical comedy and facial expressions. Coca's work on the Your Show of Shows with Sid Caesar was groundbreaking and is still influential today. According to industry experts, Coca's impact can be seen in the way modern comedians approach physical humor and character work. As David Byancoli, a TV critic and historian, states, Coca's influence on physical comedy is immeasurable. Her ability to create humor through facial expressions and body language has inspired countless comedians, from Lucille Ball to Tina Fey. Moreover, Coca's work challenged gender norms in comedy and paved the way for future female comedians. As Sarah Silverman, a comedian and actress, notes, Imogen Coca was a trailblazer for women in comedy. She proved that women could be just as funny, if not funnier, than men. Her contributions to the industry should not be underestimated. Coca's influence can also be seen in the way storytelling is approached in television. Her work on your show of shows helped establish the format of the sketch comedy show, which has since become a staple of television programming. As Brian Cully states, Coca and Caesar's work on your show of shows helped to establish the sketch comedy format that we see in shows like Saturday Night Live today. They were true innovators in the world of television. In addition to her impact on the industry, Coca's work has also left a lasting impression on those she has inspired. As Silverman notes, Coca's work has always resonated with me. Her ability to create humor out of everyday situations and her commitment to her craft are truly inspiring. Overall, Imogen Coca's contributions to the entertainment industry are significant and enduring. Her impact on comedy, storytelling, and gender norms continues to be felt today, and her work will undoubtedly continue to inspire future generations of comedians and entertainers. Imogen Coca, known for her role as Shad in It's About Time, was of Spanish and Irish descent. Her paternal grandfather had emigrated from Coca, Segovia, Spain to the U.S. Coco was married twice. Her first husband, Robert Burton, arranged music for many of her sketches. Her second husband, Hector King Donovan, frequently performed with her in theater. Coca's professional relationship with Joe E. Ross, her co-star in It's About Time, was less than harmonious. She did not appreciate his loud and vulgar personality, which created tension on set. Beyond her acting career, Coca's personal life was also intertwined with the world of entertainment. Her first husband, Robert Burton, was a musician and arranger, while her second husband, King Donovan, was an actor. Both men played significant roles in supporting Coca's career and were undoubtedly important in her personal life. In summary, Imogen Coca was a talented actress of Spanish and Irish descent who starred in It's About Time and had a complicated relationship with her co-star, Joe E. Ross. She was married twice, with both husbands having connections to the entertainment industry. Imogen Coca, a talented actress, led a life that was not only dedicated to her craft, but also to various causes close to her heart. She was known for her love of animals and actively supported the ASPCA throughout her life. Coca believed in the importance of treating all living beings with kindness and compassion. In addition to her passion for animals, Coca was also committed to environmental conservation. She was an advocate for preserving natural resources and educating others about the importance of sustainability. Coca often used her platform to raise awareness about these issues and encourage her fans to take action. Coca's personal values and interests often informed her work as an actress. She was known for her comedic timing and her ability to bring joy and laughter to those around her. Coca believed that humor had the power to bring people together and create a sense of community. She often chose roles that allowed her to showcase her comedic talents while also delivering important messages about kindness, compassion, and social responsibility. 
Throughout her career, Coca was involved in various philanthropic efforts. She was a longtime supporter of the United Service Organizations and frequently performed for American troops both at home and abroad. Coca believed that it was important to support those who serve our country and was honored to be able to contribute to their morale and well-being. In addition to her work with the USO, Coca was also involved in various other charitable organizations. She was a strong advocate for women's rights and supported organizations that worked to empower women and promote gender equality. Coca believed that everyone deserved equal opportunities and worked tirelessly to promote social justice and equality. Overall, Imogen Coca was a talented actress and a dedicated philanthropist. Her personal values and interests informed her work and inspired her to make a positive impact on the world around her. Through her advocacy for animals, environmental conservation, and social justice, Coca left a lasting legacy that continues to inspire and motivate others to this day. Imogen Coca was born into a performing family, with her father Jose Fernandez de Coca being a violinist and vaudeville band leader, and her mother Sadie Brady Coca, a dancer and magician's assistant. From an early age, Coca was exposed to the world of entertainment and would eventually follow in her parents' footsteps. Coca's career spanned over six decades, during which she made a name for herself as a talented comedian and actress. She began her career in vaudeville, performing alongside her mother before moving on to Broadway and eventually television. Coca is perhaps best known for her role as the comedic sidekick to Sid Caesar on the groundbreaking television Show Your Show of Shows. The show, which aired from 1950 to 1954, was a pioneer in live television and is still considered one of the greatest comedy shows of all time. Despite the success of your show of shows, Coca's career was not without its challenges. She struggled to find roles that fully utilized her talents and often found herself typecast as a comedic sidekick. However, she continued to work steadily throughout her career, appearing in numerous television shows, films, and stage productions. Coca's contributions to the world of entertainment were recognized with numerous awards and accolades, including an Emmy Award for Outstanding Lead Actress in a Comedy Series for Your Show of Shows, and a Tony Award nomination for Best Actress in a Musical for Little Me. Throughout her career, Coca remained dedicated to her craft and continued to work well into her later years. She passed away in 2001 at the age of 92, leaving behind a legacy as one of the most talented and influential comedians of her time. Imogen Coca, a trailblazing actress, left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. She was known for her comedic timing, physical comedy, and ability to portray a wide range of characters. Coca's work in television, film, and theater paved the way for future generations of performers. For those aspiring to follow in her footsteps, Coca offered the advice to always be true to yourself and your art. She believed that success comes from hard work, dedication, and staying true to one's own voice and vision. Coca also emphasized the importance of being adaptable and open to new experiences as the industry is constantly evolving. In terms of future contributions, it's important for aspiring professionals to build on the legacy of those who came before them while also pushing boundaries and exploring new territory. This can be achieved by taking risks, challenging conventions, and incorporating diverse perspectives into their work. In the end, the most important thing is to create work that resonates with audiences and leaves a lasting impact. By staying true to themselves and their art, aspiring professionals can honor the legacy of Imogen Coca while also making their own unique mark on the industry. We'd love to hear your opinions about the remarkable career of Imogen Coca, an actress who left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. With her unique comedic style, she brought joy to countless audiences and paved the way for future generations of performers. If you have any memories of watching Imogen Coca's shows or thoughts on her impact on the world of entertainment, please share them in the comments below. Your insights and experiences are invaluable to our community. We invite you to link, share, and subscribe to our channel for more content celebrating the creative spirits who have shaped the entertainment industry. Your support helps us continue to create engaging and informative content for our audience. Let's keep the conversation going and celebrate the legacy of Imogen Coca together.